Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Aaron, if you're new here, and if you're a current subscriber, returning to check out my videos, I really do appreciate it. I know I say this every time, but it's true. And it's my intro, so two birds with one stone. So today we're doing a retro trailer, like retro, retro, not just a few years ago, but back from 1993, so what is that, 29 years ago? It's called Doll Man vs. Demonic Toys. <laughs> uh, I, th I don't even remember why I put it in my playlist of trailers to review. It, it must have had something to do with that it was extremely corny. This one should be entertaining, so let us check it out. A cop from another world. What's the matter? You've never seen a cop before. And a nurse shrunk by aliens. Just the thing to drive G.I. Joe insane. Will you get the hell out of here? Are teaming up with a big partner. She's a cop in trouble. For some deadly fun and games. Toys that come to life and kill people to help a demon from hell. Jesus Christ! Not quite, slut. You can go where those toys go. You, you're the perfect size to help me kick their butts. Let's start up the entertainment, boy. <laughs> and this time... You think that one of the oxygen? Get the hell away from me! <laughs> they're picking on someone their own size. Gosh, guys, this is the best bachelor party a guy could ever ask for. <laughs> hey, hey! <gasps> Tim Thomerson, Tracy Scoggins, and Melissa Bear. Pop goes the weasel. <laughs> Doll Man versus the demonic oh. toys. You love it. It's really gonna tear you up. All right, that has got to be one of the funniest trailers I have seen in a really, really long time. Like, it's so funny and so, like, whack that I, like, want to see if this is on Netflix or Tubi or Freebie or something, like, as soon as I'm done with this reaction because it looks hilarious. The things I liked about it, well, obviously... The very beautiful, very attractive, I don't remember her name now, but, um, man, there's something about those 80s and 90s women that was just so hot. So moving on from that, it's so out there, like, okay, there are many people from another dimension or another world who stay miniature, somehow they're in our world. And they have to fight these toys that are being brought to life for some reason to bring a demon here or something. Like, it's just so out there. I love the creativity. It might be corny as hell, but man, I just love creative storytelling. And even if it's corny, I think it would be a really fun watch. I like the old school effects of them being small. And all the objects around them being, like, really big to give you that feeling that they're actually shrunk down to, um, doll size, I guess we can say. There were a bunch of movies in, like, the 50s and 60s that kind of had that theme. I remember coming across them late at night years and years ago when I had to do physical therapy. And I had to do, like, three hours of it a day. And I remember at night... I'd be up late doing my physical therapy and these old movies would be on. I always found the idea really cool, really, I don't know, creative, uh, fascinating in a way. I like that part of the trailer. There's really nothing I didn't like in this trailer, to be honest. The corny dialogue is great. I love that last line, Pop goes the weasel. Like, how do you say that with a straight, well, I guess I just did, but, um, Man, that's just, that's comedic gold. The clown in this trailer, the clown puppet or whatever, really reminded me of 
the clowns from Killer Clowns from Outer Space, which I actually did a review on, so if you want to check that out, I'll put the link to the description below. But it was almost like in this trailer they recycled one of the props or something. The creepy baby is super creepy, but also really funny. Why don't they make movies like this anymore? Like, ah, it's a shame. All right, what are your thoughts on this trailer? Do you have a favorite campy, not taking itself too seriously, but also taking itself too seriously uh, horror film from, I don't know, let's say from the 50s to the late 90s? Do you have a favorite? Uh, if you do, leave a comment below. I'd be very interested if there's other movies like this out there. All right, as always, if you'd like this video and subscribe if you haven't already, I would very much appreciate it. My name is Aaron. Thanks for watching. And I hope you come back and see me in another video. Goodbye. Pop goes the weasel. <laughs>